Mary Golda Ross is known as the Cherokee rocket scientist, an aerospace engineer, and the first Native American female engineer who helped put a man on the moon. Ross was born in Park Hill, Oklahoma on July 9, 1908, and grew up in Tahlequah, the Cherokee Nation's capital. She was the great-granddaughter of renowned Cherokee chief John Ross, and at a young age developed a special interest in math and science. She graduated from Northeastern State Teachers College, now Northeastern State University in Tahlequah, and taught math and science in public schools. Ross herself returned to school to study astronomy, and in 1942 was hired by Lockheed Aircraft Corporation in California. Her work as a mathematician there helped create engineering designs for fighter jets, missile systems, satellites and rockets, and helped launch the famous space race. In the 1960s, Ross became part of a top secret team of engineers at Lockheed who created theories for space travel. She was one of the authors of a NASA planetary flight handbook about space travel to Mars and Venus. After retiring from Lockheed in 1973, Ross became a staunch advocate for engineering and math opportunities for Native Americans and women. In her final years, she became a strong supporter of the Smithsonian's National Museum of the American Indian in Washington, D.C., and attended its grand opening at age 96. Mary Golda Ross passed away in 2008, just three months shy of her 100th birthday.